Many of you regular consumers of my content probably already know who Meet Kevin is. He's an extremely popular real estate agent slash YouTuber, and in fact, he has one of the largest channels as a real estate agent here on the platform. His channel continues to evolve and grow quite rapidly. However, over the past several weeks, he has cracked the code and Meet Kevin has broken YouTube. Hey, it's Jaime. If we're just meeting, welcome to the channel that brings actionable content to grow your business through online marketing. So if that sounds beneficial, consider subscribing. Me Kevin's channel started in 2013 and had a very traditional real estate content focus. And it's so interesting to see that just now real estate agents are starting to catch on that just now they're starting to do more video and focus on YouTube as an entire marketing strategy. And some of the biggest advocates that are showing real estate agents on how to have success here on YouTube have been Trevor Jones, Karen Carr, myself, several others that are really focusing on YouTube in a big way. But what's been even more interesting is that over the past two years, Meet Kevin has grown exponentially. He's been growing extremely quickly as a real estate agent slash YouTuber. I first became aware of his channel when he was doing his punching up strategy, which is one of the reasons that he was able to grow so quickly. He took the strategy of punching up to well-known figures like Dave Ramsey and Grant Cardone, and also picked a few fights with larger creators than him like Brian Casella, among others. And there's gonna be some of you that like that strategy and there's also gonna be others that don't like that strategy and both points are fair. Personally, I didn't think it was malicious. I think that was just part of his strategy, part of his strategy of punching up to larger names out there so his brand could grow up and be associated to them in some capacity because every time me Kevin uploads a video about Grant Cardone or Dave Ramsey, he knows he's gonna get exponential views. That's a bit about his channel and the history of me Kevin here on the platform, but what I wanna focus on today is what he's been able to do over the last 30 days. Over the past month, he's absolutely broken YouTube, he has cracked the code, and as of this recording, he's at 500 thousand subscribers in rising quickly. So it's been interesting seeing his rise and in this video I want to share some fundamental elements that I believe have led to his incredible success. The first reason is that his videos are very well produced. He's great at making videos, he knows about lighting, he knows about audio, and he knows how to tell a story. His videos are top notch. And second, he connects with his audience. He's relatable and presents incredibly well in front of a camera. He's able to connect with viewers and articulate his points fairly well. I've seen his content several different times and it's quite difficult to argue many of his points. He not only talks about the topics that he wants to cover on the channel, but he actually shows personal results. He shows results from his trading accounts, from his real estate investing, and viewers are really drawn to that. Success sells. But what I really wanna hone in on is the concept that he's really tapped into with YouTube and that's abundance. Before, scarcity used to be so valuable where large creators would upload once a week or once a month and that was the way to generate so many views per video. As an example, Mark Rober only uploads 12 times per year, thus limiting his supply and more people are gonna watch every single upload. But in his defense, the content that he produces is incredibly difficult to make and takes a lot of time to complete just one video. But what I'm talking about with Kevin is that he's taking it to a different extreme. Every single day, he's making three to six videos and uploading them. Not only is the ability to make all of those videos in one day amazing, but what's even more amazing is that every single one of his videos hits every single one of his videos gets tens into hundreds of thousands of views within one day. So he's capitalizing on all the fundamental elements that have made him so successful that we just discussed about and is exponentially expanding on them. And the reason that his videos are hitting is because he's covering topics that are trending right now. He's able to talk about what's on the news right now very frequently because what's on the news right now changes every single day and changes almost by the hour, especially with this whole pandemic 
that we're presently in. So as people are staying home, not only do they have time, but they're actively looking for this type of information to make sense of it. So what he's doing is incredibly genius. He's taken all of the information from the media and is presenting it in a more tangible way. So the media is not only providing the topic of the day, but also raising awareness to the topic of the day and is also physically presenting the content that Meet Kevin can use as talking points. So he's taking all of this information, passing it through his filter and presenting it to his millions of viewers. So in a way, he's his own news channel. This strategy is incredible, but also takes an incredible amount of time to deploy. It is very difficult to put out all of these videos every single day. And the only other single creator that I've seen do this at a very high level is Tim Pool, which I'll link down below and he's been doing this for years. More than anything, I just find this stuff fascinating and it's such an inspiration. Whether you like him, hate him, or are indifferent towards him, going to his channel and taking notes is well worth your time. All right, well now that we have a bit of inspiration on what's possible out there, it's time to get back to business. So I'll leave a video right here that's gonna help you do just that. And if you found value today, please be sure to subscribe so we can talk again soon.